Hello, how's it going? What's up? What's new? Comment below. Let me know. How are you? How's it going? Welcome back to Sarah's Style. Welcome to my first vlog. It is Saturday shenanigans. It is so nice out. It's lockdown in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. That's where I live, if you don't know. My brain is so... I indulged this morning, and I'm like... Brain farting the whole day already. So it's 4 o'clock. We woke up super late today. And we're going to go do some errands. We're going to go to the new Sephora in Lindenwood. And then we're going to grab some food. First vlog, why not? You guys just come along. Do you want to be in it? No. We're not there yet, guys. He still doesn't want to be in it. I'm going to show you guys my outfit when I get out of the car. But I'm such a vibe today. This hat's hot as shit. Oh, man. I swore. So, my hair is so crazy. So let's get started. We'll see you at the, we'll see you when I get to Sephora. I'll show you guys what I got. So we just got some smoothies from McDonald's. Is it, is it dollar drinks? How much did you pay for these? $4. Ooh, it's $2 smoothie season. Here you go. No, it's $4 each. $4 each? You paid $8? Yeah. Never mind. It's not. It's not drink days. What the heck, McDonald's? What the heck? Look, we're driving right by. Do they have the advertisement? Is it dollar drink? Oh, no. Birthday. Birthday. Oh, there's a decked out birthday car. Happy birthday, whoever that is. Happy birthday. No, Can you not swear or say anything that is going to get me kicked off of YouTube? in this video. Thank you. Oh my god. It's kind of like, I don't know how to explain this. It's like love and hate with having him in my videos. Cause like, I love, I like really want to film with you and I want to get comfortable with the stuff that you say. The stuff that he says, guys. He is the definition of zero Fs to give. Zero. So anyways, I got a blueberry pomegranate smoothie. These are so good. So good. And you got strawberry and banana. Basic. Basic. Biatch. Woo! Saturday shenanigans. We just finished at Sephora. I got so much stuff. Normally, I, say, I didn't get like a lot of stuff, but normally I'd only get like one thing or nothing. And Bay spoiled me. This might be the thumbnail. Oh, my hair is crazy. This is, this is probably not going to be the thumbnail. Ah, I'm excited! So we're just in the parking lot. Bay is... Oh my gosh. My hair is just... So we're in the parking lot. So I'm gonna show you what I got. I'm literally so excited. I can't. Okay, so first, this is how I am in my day-to-day -day life. I am this all over the place, this and this all the time. So I was just gonna get the Fenty Glow lip gloss and I like put it in the basket and which let me say the sephora in lindenwoods that new one that just opened up the employees are so nice i literally really really love this one i usually don't like going into sephora for the obvious reasons like at the mall and stuff so this one they were so nice and yeah so i got yeah so i got the single one and then on checkout with like those when they have those like little like mini everything I saw this and I was like, maybe I should get this instead. Right? Like why? It's like a little bit 
smaller than the other one, but it comes with another one and a keychain holder. So you can put this on my keys and just Rihanna it up anytime, anywhere. Like, yes. Yes. I literally want to put it on right now and just watch it. But no, I'll do that at home. Follow me on Instagram if you want to see the swatches. I'll leave it here. And then the reason why I went to Sephora was for my eyeliner. I have zero eyeliner. I haven't had eyeliner in like the longest time. But I just, I just haven't gone to Sephora. And I just like had no motivation to. So then this one opened up and I was like, woo, let's go get my eyeliner. So I use the liquid, like a liquid pen. It's called the Pretty Easy Clinique liquid eyeliner pen. Liquid eyelining pen. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It is the holy grail. Oh my gosh. I have used every kind of eyeliner in this entire... He puts the AC on. Excuse me, sir. I'm talking. This is my video. Beep, beep at home. Yeah. So I've used like every single eyeliner. Like I've used gel, I've used liquid, I've used sticks, I've literally like every single kind. And this one is the holy grail. Like it's amazing. So that's what I got. And the favorite thing that I got that Bay bought for me. He bought everything, but this is what he like actually bought for me any like couples out there technically it's like the same it's like the same money because like we live together and stuff and it all your money is my money Awkward. <laughs> i got a morphe palette oh my gosh oh my gosh it's so beautiful i got a morphe palette I have one at home that I use religiously like I've had it for the longest time and it's like my baby I've dropped it like twice and actually cried about it he's been there it's literally like you know. <laughs> I just love the morphe my morphe palette so I got another one my makeup looks are about to be watching me get all hyped about stuff so yeah that's all that I got I feel like that was like a really big bag for just three items but that was the Sephora haul again if you want to see what they look like follow me on Instagram so what are we doing next where are we off to next we're actually gonna get some food next and I have no idea where we're gonna get food where do you want to get food? Mm, okay. Oh, he's looking. I kind of wanted to like do somewhere local, support local. But I'm also just like really hungry. What are you in the mood for? Mm. He always says anything. But when I'm like, hey, we should get this, he's like, mm, no. Bro, this is local. Yeah. Maybe we should like do something a little faster. Do you want to go downtown? Want to go Forks? No. It's so like I would love to go to the Forks and like go get some local food there, but there's been like anti-masks, crazy people over there, and so I don't want to. Go there and get COVID. I'm thinking very hard right now. Let's go get those burgers. Where? You know where. You sure? Yeah. The sitter in the car? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> the, what this, in the main place. Okay, we're gonna go to this burger place and like he, the way he butchers their name 
is like ghetto literally ghetto so we're gonna i literally don't even know what their name is it's something with an s but c. i'll say it so we would see with a c no Sidder. Oh, it was Sidder. Oh my god, okay, okay. I got it. So he says this place, it's called Sidar. Sidarwood. That's what he thinks this place is called. In Maine. Sidar, Sidar in Maine. Sidder in Maine. Okay, that's what it's... Hi, if you didn't know, I have a brown boyfriend. Sidar and Wood. Burger place. This is what this man thinks this place wood is it? called. You said wood. Where do you wood? You said wood. I've never said no, wood. So, yeah. wood. I'm glad we're here. Cigar in Maine. Regardless. Regardless. This is what he thinks. Cigar in Maine. Let's go there. Let's go to Cigar in Maine. Hi guys. Okay, so this burger place is packed. So we drove all the way to Oak Bank, which is like a little bit outside of Winnipeg. That's like 20 minutes, 30 minutes outside of Winnipeg. Not that bad. At the burger place. What is it called? What is it called, Fred? Sure. <laughs> it's called Cedar in Maine not cedar like cedar wood that's why I kept saying cedar wood cedar cedar like the wood say say it say it with us he's so fob so yeah I don't want to wait in line I'm not a wait in line for food type of gal Oh, I'm sorry, somebody coming. <laughs> okay, so we're trying to figure out what we should do. So, yeah, I'm not waiting. I'm not waiting in the. There's no way. I'm going to show you. There's quite a bit of people. It's quite a bit of people. No. I don't believe that. Not to sound like rude. That sounded kind of rude, but I'm hungry. So we're gonna go to Half Moon. So we're gonna go to Half Moon. It's probably gonna be just as packed. But sorry, are you trying to kill us? <laughs> okay, so we made it to Half Moon, and the line is longer than my entire life. It's longer than my entire future. Like, I can't imagine what the, it's only drive-through, right? Oh my gosh. It's literally like two blocks. That's how long the car line is. And now we're, we're in the line debating if we should stay in the line. What do you think? I don't know if I can do this for food. I'm so hangry right now. Nope. Next. So the weather took an absolute turn. We were going to go get food. We're gonna go get an A&W and then go for a picnic. But it is like thunderstorming where we're about to go. Can you hear the rain? Cloudy, oh, did you see the lightning? Did you see the lightning? Did you see the lightning? There's no picnic happening. There's no picnic happening. Oh my gosh, lightning right next to an electrical box. Electrical walks, an electrical wall, uh, the, the, an electrical land. Literally, like the sky, like. 
like it's so like what the heck happened? What? Just like entered the twilight zone, like what? What? After the sunshine. Okay, so we got our food and we came to a park and we're just gonna eat in the car. We're gonna eat back there. Bay. Oh. Bay was like, you wanna eat in the back? I was like, okay, so what you trying to do? But it might be comfortable to eat back there, so. Let me show you what I got. What we got. We both got matzo burgers. Can you see? Oh that goodness. <laughs> it's not as easy as when you were a kid. No, it's not as easy hey, as when you were a kid. See, I told you we'd find it eventually. Oh nice! We just found something that we've been looking for for a little while. Oh, this is like a really fun date. Oh yeah, it's actually comfortable there. Yeah, I've never sat back here before. I've had a car for a year and I've never sat in the back seat. you never sat in the back seat in your car? No. Have you? Good question. Comment below. Has any of you guys sat in the back seat of your cars? I feel like. Are you familiar with a big fuck back thing? People fucking it up. Stop swearing. Oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> That's so true. Oh my gosh. Yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy. I'm so full. <laughs> we had a little date in the car. And we literally are like relaxing. Like he's like feet up. Can you see his stinky feet? Feet up, chilling. It's raining. The weather like took such a sad turn. We were supposed to picnic outside. But we picnicked in the car, so it's the same thing. <laughs> He's really chilling. So now we're gonna go and we're gonna go get groceries. Okay. You forgot? Yeah. <clears throat> What's your scary movie tonight? I ask him every single night, every single night, and he says yes, and we don't. You're a scary cat, you don't like to watch scary movies. Well, we'll just see you guys at home. I feel like this vlog, this vlog was supposed to be so much more funner. Like, way more funner, and like everything failed. You we were hangry, so we didn't want to wait in lines. And the rain. I feel like it's like the rain is karma to us not wanting to wait in line. Like, oh, you don't want to wait in line? Well, you don't get no picnic. No picnic for you. Maybe we'll try again tomorrow to have a picnic. I might get some stuff today at the grocery store for tomorrow. I got a picnic tomorrow. Can you give me one of these? Hey guys. So it is two days later. It is Monday. It's not Saturday anymore. So Saturday has ended and the day just like really did not go as planned. The weather absolutely canceled our day. So I was just like, whatever, I'm over this. So I just thought, you know what? Why don't you just come along with me on my day off? Like, is this going to be a day off shenanigans vlog? So I had a day off on Saturday, which you guys saw what we did. And then yesterday was Sunday and we just like relaxed. We had a family day. Um, and then now it's Monday and Monday is my get beep done day I go and I do all of my errands all of my boyfriend's errands because he doesn't do them himself 
So it adds to mine. So that's what we're gonna do. So come along with me. You just got a coffee at Tim Hortons. It is 31 outside, plus 31 outside. And I got a hot coffee. Yep. He just did like light makeup today. I'm wearing a cute jean dress. Always dress to impress when you're running your errands. Because one, that's when you run into everybody, like everybody's mom, dad, brother, and sister. And two, it just makes you feel like such a baddie on your days off. So I'm feeling like a baddie. I'm gonna go start my errands. I'm gonna go get beep done today. Why am I drinking this? See you at the next stop. Okay, so we did the first errand of the day. It's really funny. I used to just drop off some paperwork for my boyfriend and there was like a lady outside and she was like oh do you want me to just like bring them inside for you so you don't have to like walk around and like she worked there and stuff and I knew that she worked there my mental health will not let me give you these papers like I need to make sure that they get inside and like and she was like so nice She's like oh yeah I understand but I felt like I don't know like I felt bad saying no because like she's offering to do something so nice but like my my trust issues were like sarah don't trust anybody nope nope I'm, I'm at pole park right now i'm at the mall i'm gonna go to the bank and i'm gonna go to h&m and i'm gonna go to urban planet my plan is to buy nothing i don't need any clothes right now i need some shoes but i don't need clothes so let's see how i do i think i'm gonna do well i'm not gonna get anything nope sarah don't get anything but yeah i'm gonna go i'm gonna go time to go let's go i'm back i'm done with the mall an hour later an hour later this is fueling me through the day. I had so much iced coffee over the weekend, like so many fraps. I just wanted coffee today and like I'm regretting it, but enjoying it. I just parked and I'm waiting for B to get off of work. He has like 20 minutes until I have to go pick him up. So you guys wanna see what I got? So my goal was to find some sandals, which like I didn't really even look for them. But I went to H&M and I bought a whole outfit at H&M. It's like so cute. I just like couldn't pass up. And just so much stuff. Like, should I show you? I'll show you some of the stuff I got. So I got a cute pair of sunnies. These are super cute. I got, I have so many like cute, I got such cute accessories. Ugh. I'm not even gonna open this. So check out my Instagram. I'll post, I'll post a haul. Instagram, over here. Go follow me. And I got this cute like scarf. It's gonna be such a cute wrap. Like I think I'm gonna wear it as a wrap for like the beach or I'm gonna probably turn it into cute top. And then I got like this cute headband. It'd be really cute. I wear a lot of leather. So I thought that'd be cute. So that's what I got from Aldo. And then like, sorry. I got these really cute earrings from H&M. I seen them like the last time that I went there which was like a little bit ago. I guess like a month ago I went there. And I saw these cute earrings. Oh, sorry. And I just thought they were so cute. I don't even know if it's focusing, but can't really tell, but they're like, it's really good, like pink and purple. It's like pink and purple and like, whatever, whatever. I will post them on my Instagram. I got this really cute two piece. Like this is like this Heather Gray two piece and it's really cute and like 
I'm super, super into like heather gray, but the a little more on the beige side. So like very light. It's like an oatmeal, like a gray oatmeal. I'm so into this color right now. Like I think it might be my summer, my summer color. And then I went to RW and Co. And then I got my boyfriend some cute summer pants. Like look at this color. They were on sale. They always have like really good sale items. So that's what I got. That's what I got. My bank trip was successful. It was actually really awesome. So like I was waiting in the bank line. There's a line outside of the bank. And the lady who like came out to greet us, like asked me like, what do I need? And answered all my questions. And I didn't even have to go to the bank anymore. So thank you lady at the bank who saved me time and let me go wander around the mall. It's really hot in here. So I didn't do well. I didn't do well. Like money wise. I only paid $22 for eight items at Aldo and that was like insane. So I think that's like pretty successful. If you don't tell yourself that you're not gonna buy anything when you go to the mall, you won't find stuff. So I set myself up. I'll say like, I don't need anything. I'm not gonna get anything, blah, 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 blah. And then I'll find the best stuff. And like, I'm such a happy girl. So that is my shopping tip. My shopping tip to you guys is that. You gotta like balance with life. Balance with life. So I'm just gonna eat. I got a pretzel from the mall too. I, oh my God, why is this? this oh, there's this car. It's like parked right next to me. Why? Why out of all of the parking spaces? You want to park next to mine? Staring at me. It's like, what is she doing? Why is she filming herself? Why not? Why not, right? I had coffee. I can't, I don't even remember. They said this in the beginning. But I went for coffee with my dad. He's looking at me. Stop. I'm not weird. I'm just trying to be a YouTube star. Yeah, so I got coffee with my dad this morning. AKA, 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 oh my God, I can't speak English. We just ate McDonald's in the car. We just been having car dates because of lockdown and all this stuff. I have no idea what I'm doing for supper. I hope I don't have to go to the store. I think we're done here. I think we're done. That was... That was my day off shenanigans. You guys got to come and like vibe, vibe with me throughout my days off. I go back to work tomorrow. My weekend's over. I'm gonna start the work week tomorrow. My work week starts on Tuesdays. So I am very blessed to have like Mondays to myself. That's like the only thing that came out of COVID for me that was a bonus was Oh my god, I'm so sorry, but like I'm sweating. I literally can you see this. Like look at Oh my god, look at this. I'm just sweating. Like this is so gross, guys. Look at this. Yeah. What was I even talking about? What was I talking about What was I talking about? What the heck? I am like Make sure, make sure you subscribe, you like, comment, turn your post notifications on, do it all. Winter depression is officially over, officially over, O-B-E-R, over. So it's main character energy all beeping season. I will see you in my next video.